Okay, got everything squared away. Um, the squeak, the noise that I was hearing was the the angle cylinders are apparently the seals are so new that they were squeaking. I just put some WD on them and they stopped squeaking. Uh, when I went to test the plow to try to use it to get it to stop squeaking five minutes into that uh, the plow was barely lifting so doing some checking uh, the motor was getting really warm and so was the positive cable was getting really warm so I went down and I got a new motor and you can see there that the ground is different they got it on the right on the motor instead of on the inside on this ear because apparently people are having trouble with the with the ground and burning up the motors so so I got a new one and the plow works awesome um, I'll show you here in a second I'm not really sure I, I don't know if the plow has actually run as good as it does now since I've ever had it so I'm pretty happy with that And that's how, that's how it's supposed to work. Uh, it's supposed to be uh, two seconds to fully raise and four seconds to go from one side all the way to the other side. So uh, now I'm just waiting on the snow Friday to give it a real good test run. Another thing I wanted to say is I got a bunch of new screens and uh, every year from now on the beginning of the plowing season I'm gonna put a brand new screen on that pump um, no matter what I'm just gonna put a new one on drain the fluid pop a new one on because uh, I, I really don't want to I have to buy a new pump every every year, every couple years. Um, if I got to put a new motor on every three years, the last one was three years old. You know that ain't that ain't so bad, but the pump is a different story. Um, hope this this video helps some people out there, maybe having some trouble.